It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood, a beautiful day for a neighbor. Won't you be mine? Won't you be mine? Won't you be my virtual neighbor? Hi everybody, it's me, Mr. Joel. And I'm Miss Katie, and we're so happy for another day to sing with you. Yeah, I love singing with everybody. Me too. <laughs> I hope that you've been having fun singing at home too. And parents, I hope you're singing along with us. Um, I thought we could sing a song that I sing with our preschoolers all the time. Uh, Jesus loves me. Uh, I love that was song that the one so you were much. That was the one I was hoping for. Okay, so we've been talking a lot about Jesus, and I want us to sing as loud as we can, as beautifully as we can, about how much he loves us. Okay, so at home, let's get your hands out and ready to do our motions. Okay, so we're going to sing and do motions at the same time. What do you think? That sounds amazing, Miss Katie. Okay, let's do it. Do we jump around during this one? No, this one's a little bit more calm. It gives you peace. Uh, oh, like a piece of pizza. <laughs> yeah. Okay, you ready? <laughs> Here we go, Miss okay, Katie. Okay, let's do it. They do? Yeah. When did you teach them that, Miss Katie? Just a lot of times. So we're going to do Si Cristo Me Ama. Ready? Si Cristo Me Ama. Si Cristo Me Ama. Si Cristo Me Ama. La Biblia dice así. What other languages Beautiful. do they know it in? They know it in French. French? Yeah. I don't even know it in French. You want me to teach you? I would love that. Okay, it's oui, Jesus, Mema. Ready? Blue, de blah, de blue. Yep. Oui, with singing Jesus Loves Me because I want to talk about this guy Jesus, right? You learned that he could walk on water and that he could calm a storm. And today I'm going to tell you about a really exciting celebration that happened. So like I told you, he had done so many miracles. He also healed people. He made sick people feel better. He made a blind man see. Oh. I know he did incredible things. Yes. How did he do those things? Because he was the son of God. God who made the whole world sent his son, Jesus, to prove his love for us. Wow. I know. So today we're in the book of Mark. That's in the New Testament. And Jesus kept a really big promise. God had said that one day a savior would come and he would ride on a donkey and that he would be king. So, yes. I've never ridden on a donkey. Really? <laughs> I watched you real bad. Me too. But I've never been on a donkey. On a horse, though, I have. Yeah. But this was really special that he was on a donkey. And like I told you, so many people loved Jesus and were excited to see him. They were so excited, Joel, to uh -huh. see him riding into Jerusalem on a donkey that they took their jackets uh -huh. off, their coats, and put them on the ground. And then they grabbed palm branches from the trees. What? I think I have some right there. Where? Mm-hmm. Okay. Right there. They grabbed palm branches. Oh. Do we have some? Yeah. Awesome. Can I have one? Peekaboo. Peekaboo. Okay. Wow. Okay. They, they were actually not just for peekaboo. Oh. They were okay. because they were so excited and wanted to praise Jesus, who would be king. So they they waved their branches and they said a word called Hosanna. Can you say Hosanna? Ready? On the count of three. One, two, three. Three. Hosanna. Hosanna! Good. Hosanna. 
Hosanna. So Hosanna means save us. They wow. knew that Jesus was a savior and this was a way to praise him. Hosanna. Hosanna. Not just grown-ups filled the streets saying Hosanna. There were kids too. Little ones? Yeah, little kids. Oh. I picture babies everywhere, toddlers crawling around. Like a little baby was like this. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah? Like that. yeah. Wow. People were so excited to see him. They were saying Hosanna really loud. So I thought you and I could compete of who could say Hosanna louder. Uh, who do you think will say I have say been louder? waiting my entire life for this moment, Who do you Catherine? think can say Hosanna louder? You, me, or Mr. Joel? Okay, ready? So I'll start. I'll say Hosanna really loud on the count of three. Ready? One, two, three. Hosanna! Okay, that was pretty loud. Now your your turn. Hosanna. Oh, that wasn't very loud, was it? I think I won that round. Do you want to try again? I got nervous. Okay. Try it. Remember, you're really excited okay. to see Jesus. Yeah, Jesus is right in front of you, riding on a donkey, fulfilling the promise that he has made. Ready? Here we go. Here we go. One, two, three. Hosanna! Wow. I really hope no one had babies sleeping that night. Mom came back and told us about that. Okay, now it's your turn. Let me see if you can say Hosanna even louder than I or Mr. Joel could. Ready? One, two, three. Say it loud. Wow, that was really loud. Oh, that was pretty loud. <laughs> Good job. I'm all over here. Good job. Okay, so people were so excited to see Jesus. They mm -hmm. knew that he had come to save them from all the mistakes that they had made. And they knew that he was going to prove his love in a big, big way, which we're going to talk more about. Now, some people were actually jealous of Jesus. Like I said, some people were excited and some people were jealous. And so some people that were really jealous of Jesus said something mean. They said, Jesus, make your friends be quiet. And you know what Jesus said? He said, if they were quiet, even the rocks would sing. I know. Can you do rocks sing? Yeah. That rocks. <laughs> Rocks don't sing or make any noise, no. right? But they would because God is the creator of it all. All of creation was made to praise Jesus. So I thought we could sing a song and praise as loud as we can. So what I want you to do at home, if you're sitting down, I want you to stand up. Parents too, stand up. Yep. And we're going to sing a song called Hosanna. And my dare to you is to sing it as loud as you can to show praise, meaning thanking Jesus for his love. Okay? Can I go get it ready? Yeah, let's okay. get it ready. Let me Hosanna. get it ready. Hosanna. Okay, we're going to sing Hosanna Rock. Joel, come on and sing with us. Oh, I love this song. <laughs> Oh, oh. 
singing that song with you. I love knowing that you are praising Jesus in your homes, right? I love the drum solo. Like, yes. I know, you really love that. So when you sing Hosanna, remember that's a way that you're thanking Jesus for his big, big love for us. Mm -hmm. And what I loved about that story is that Jesus said even the rocks would sing to him because all creation is made to worship him. So I thought we could do something. You could do something in your homes. If you guys ever take family walks, I know that I've been taking family walks. Have you been doing that? Lots of family walks. So if you take a little bit of family walks around your neighborhood, mm -hmm. there's you might find some rocks. So I found some rocks here. Oh. And what we're going to do is if you, can, if you have paints at home, or paint pens or even chalk why don't you decorate some rocks so I want to show you how I decorated mine so I'm gonna bring these and show you okay so this says Jesus, Jesus. loves you can you guys read that Jesus loves you so I made these I painted them and said that and I thought that we could hide them around wherever you're on your family walk put them somewhere out in the in nature so people can see it and remind themselves that they are loved okay so you could do this you could write Jesus loves you or you could just make happy faces and people will see that and feel happy you could make hearts or you could do decorate it however you like and remind and it will remind us of the story that even the rocks would sing to Jesus I know isn't that amazing so Okay. That's your project. It's a pretty big project if you want to do that with your family. Those are so beautiful, Miss Katie. Yeah, and I think that they will just remind people of the love that Jesus has for them. Can I see one? Yeah, go ahead. Oh, okay. Yeah. I know, right? Look at this. This one says Jesus. And it's, oh, Hosanna! Oh, oh, Hosanna! Oh, this one's singing! Wow, you made it sing! Yeah! <laughs> you could do that too if you'd like. You can make your rock sing to Jesus too. Everything is made to worship God. Yeah, I'm so glad it sings. I didn't want to take it for granted. Wow. <laughs> All right, are you ready for our last song? Oh, yeah. Friends, I hope that you remember the story of Palm Sunday and how we're created to praise Jesus. And we're going to talk next week about how he's going to prove his big, big love for us. So I can't wait to see you next week. Too. All right? But for now... It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood, a beautiful day for a neighbor. Would you be mine? Could you be mine? Won't you be my virtual neighbor?